From Earth, we can see two types of eclipses. Eclipses of the Sun, which are called solar eclipses, and eclipses of the Moon, lunar eclipses. These occur when the Sun, Earth, and Moon align in a straight or almost straight configuration. Astronomers call this syzygy. The order they're in when they line up determines what type of eclipse there will be. A solar eclipse happens when the Moon passes between the Sun and Earth and either fully or partially blocks the Sun's light. This only happens occasionally because the Moon doesn't orbit in the exact same plane as the Sun and Earth do. There are three kinds of solar eclipses, total, partial, and annular. A total solar eclipse happens when the Moon lines up between the Sun and Earth such that it completely blocks the face of the Sun. This creates a circular shadow on a small part of the Earth, and people located in it will experience a total eclipse. Since the Earth and the Moon are constantly moving, this shadow will move too, tracing out a path called the path of totality. During totality, the sky becomes dark, and this is the only time you can see the outer atmosphere of the Sun with your naked eye. This is called the corona, and normally it's obscured by the bright face of the Sun. A partial eclipse occurs when the Moon is not exactly in line with the Earth and Sun, and the Moon only partially obscures the Sun. From our perspective, this looks like the Moon has taken a bite out of the Sun. An annular solar eclipse happens when the Moon passes between the Sun and Earth, but the Moon is a little further away. It turns out that the Moon isn't always the same distance from Earth, and when it's further away, it appears smaller than the Sun and doesn't completely block it out. During annularity, the Moon appears as a dark disk on top of a larger bright disk, creating what looks like a ring of fire around the Moon. Solar eclipses only happen during the day because you have to be on the side of the Earth that's facing the Sun. If you've seen an eclipse at night, you've experienced a lunar eclipse. Now we can see the Moon because it reflects sunlight. At night, you're on the part of the Earth that's facing away from the Sun, and the Moon becomes visible against the night sky. Lunar eclipses occur when the Earth lines up between the Sun and the Moon and blocks the sunlight from hitting the Moon. Because of our understanding of astronomy, we're able to predict the exact moment when the Moon will block sunlight from hitting the Earth and create a solar eclipse, or when the Earth will block sunlight from hitting the Moon and create a lunar eclipse. I highly recommend you look up when the next eclipse is happening near you and make a plan to experience syzygy.